<laughs> Hello, Jesus Baby Club. Welcome on board to another edition on our Jesus Baby Club. Yesterday, or in our previous video, we talked about how children like to play with phones. We've heard of cases where children threw their parents' phone into the toilet and flushed it. Or cases where they decided to help their parents take care of the phone. And in the end, they helped daddy and mommy to wash the phone with soap and water. And of course, you know that's the end of the phone. Okay. Sometimes as parents, we too get so busy and feel like the children are disturbing. And one good way to distract them or keep them calm is to give them a phone to play with. But what we don't know is that these children, if they're not monitored, they could go to sites that are not favorable. As a Christian mother or a Christian parent, how do you distract your children? How do you help them when they are bored? How do you keep them in check, in place, so that you can do other things in the house? And there's always a lot to do. All right. You can drop your comments on how you help your children, how you distract them from getting bored. Please drop your comments under this video to be appreciated and to be replied if, there's, if necessary. All right. Also, remember to like this video and subscribe, particularly subscribe, so you can keep getting all our videos and so you'll be the first to know when our next video comes out. Okay, so we're talking about keeping children busy and making sure that they don't get bored and too used to our phones. Yes, see Jesus, baby. Yes. See what we are talking about. She's with a phone. And so how phone. do we make her stop using the phone? How do we help her to stop using mommy or daddy's phone, so she can start using something else that is, I mean, doing something else that will be more edible, more edifying to her, that is more healthy to her as a child. Hello, treasure. Say hello. Hello. Say hi. Hi. Say bless you. Say bless you. Bless you. Good. All right, treasure. You're yeah, going to drop the phone. You. You're going to drop the phone. And you're going to write for mommy. Now, one of the things we do is so, yes, like you. what I do is, yes, you. I, well, for her age, it's not supposed yes, to be writing yes, according yes, to the you. educational system here in Spain. Yes, but yes, I see it as one of the way to distract her. So I allow her write either with a pencil and a, a paper or with our own small board treasure come on write for mommy good girl let's see let's try the right good girl all right so a pencil. yeah the pencil is here look at it here look at it mm. i fix it not to fix it yes i fix it this is my right material Good. So with this, I keep her busy. So she can write one. Write one for mommy. Write one straight. Good. Then write two. Curve and cut. Muy bien. Uh oh. Uh -oh. This is this is not clear. All right. Write properly again. Write one straight. One straight. Good. Write two. Write two. Curve and cut. Uh, well, that's it's, about it. It's big. That's about it. It's okay, big. one more time. No, Let's wipe this. Let's wipe this. Wipe. 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 Try to wipe it. So, turn this way. Wipe All right, so wipe. No, wipe right first. No, right one no, and two. No, blessing. No. Of course, blessing want to write. So, okay, you write by yourself. One. Straight. One. Two. Mm. Then two. Curve and cut. Give space and write again. One. 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 Oh, okay. Then two. 
space here. Yeah, yeah, two here. Curve and cut. Okay, so when she writes like that, you can do the other one. When she writes like that. <sighs> Mommy. Good, continue writing. You can clean and do the other one. So that keeps her busy for some time and I'm able to do some things. And sometimes when she gets bored, of course, children you get bored so fast. No, 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 no. Give her, give her, you use this. Give her this. You use this. You use this. Use this. Good. You both? Yeah, you use that to write, then use this. Uh, good. Do all the shapes you want. All the shapes you want on the board. All the shapes you want on the board. All the shapes you want on the board. Yeah. All right. So, you know, when they have siblings, sometimes you have to settle who uses this and who uses that toy. Not an easy thing to look after children in Europe. But we are coping by the grace of God. All right. So, when we occupy them with that, they leave our phones for us and we'll have our phones to use for better things. And at least we'll save them the unhealthy addiction to phones. You know, some children get so addicted to using phones, so the extent they extend bring it to church. And when service is going on, you see them pressing their phones, playing games inside the church, doing things that we don't know. Now, to you as a parent, you probably think the stress of looking after these children are so much and then you try to just use that to pull them off you know to distract them you allow them use the phone so that they won't disturb you but do you know oh beautiful this is beautiful treasure did this oh yeah it's beautiful all right you clean it you clean it now and write one and two for mommy Cut and cut okay you clean clean again Clean again, clean again, clean again. Muy bien. Now go and write to mommy. When you finish writing, you give it for mommy to see. Here we I'm go. In person. Yes. Okay, look for it. it. Must have fallen. Check the floor. Yeah. All right. So, when you think that is a way of distracting them, you don't most of the time even check what they are watching. And this is very dangerous for our children. We don't want our children learning what we have not taught them. <laughs> Or what the Bible doesn't support them to learn. Remember that we are just teachers, and that they must do what God wants them to do. And the only way they can do that is for us to guide them. We are the ones that will guide them. All right, let's let's color, let's color, okay? Let's color. Let's leave that since blessing will not allow you write again. Let's color. Where is our pencils? Our pencils are here. Where is our Color books. Here is a color book. Color book. Yeah, we go. Good. Unicorn. Treasure is in the color of a unicorn today. Yes. And use any of the colors that you want. Just color. Make sure you color inside and not out. Okay. That's outside. Color inside the unicorn. This is unicorn. Don't color tree with black. If you want to color tree, you use green. Green. Green to color tree, tree, green tree, yeah, yeah, yeah. Use. That's unicorn, yeah. That's the cone of unicorn. Color here with um, in this place with green. Okay, you can do any color you want there. No working. If it's not working, you change it here. Look at your pencils. Pick another one, any color you want. Yes, yes so continue. Good care. So you find out that. They watch things that we are not aware of, and this can be dangerous to them as children of God. So, what do we do? We have to take out the phones and find other ways to distract them. We play music. Sometimes we play music here and we dance along. Play a gospel music. Not just any music, a gospel music. You know, these children in the church, for example, if you take away their mobiles and take away their tablets, discover that... You may think they're not hearing the message, they're not hearing the sermon, they're not hearing the song, they're not hearing the things that are going on in the church, but they're actually hearing. It's entering their subconscious, and before you know it, they will start acting it and leaving it. So don't just think that they're not hearing it so they can play with um, uh, your phones or play with tablets so that they won't distract you. They're hearing that word, it needs to enter them. So 
time to leave the key uh, the the tablets at home time to leave the phones at home time to stop the children from playing with phones and time to look for earlier uh, ways to distract them and keep them calm and keep them cool yes they're going to mess up the house yes they are going to touch what, everything in the house yes they are going to give you extra work but that's the joy of parenthood we just keep doing what we can do and leave what we cannot do for another day because you don't have to kill yourself beautiful did you color this Voila. use color where's color red? red look for color red and color this good color this for mommy take color that for mommy good girl all right now remember that the bible says train up a child in the way it should go and that when it's old it will not depart from it so your duty is to train them up even as little children now if they get too used and too glued to your mobile phones the time will come that they will become useless to you and to their environment good now take your pencil and write on the paper Write on the paper one and two. Remember that two is curved and cut. Okay. So sit and continue. So don't get them to use your, your phones. Don't get them to use. Don't even buy them a phone. They are too young for phones. Tell the children of this age. Treat them to the word of God. Treat them to songs, gospel songs. Treat them to a dance. Uh, treat them to writing. Treat them to house. a book. You can read a book for them. In the house. All right, darling. You can draw for them. You can show them samples of how to draw. Depends on what you can do. Anything that you can do that is edifying is okay to distract them. Let me draw in the house for treasure. The house has two windows. Door. And I'll a door. door. Yes. Ah, ah, and then the roof. A roof. Beautiful roof. roof. Look. Good. <laughs> Okay, chimney. Yes, a chimney. House has a chimney also. Where the smoke can go out. Choo, 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 choo. Off. All right, so you go and color. It color off. this. Color it, then we'll come and draw wolf. I was coming to the house to scare the people. So color the house first, then we'll draw wolf. All right, beautiful people. Our Jesus babies do not need contaminations. There are so many things in the world that contaminates our children. Let's avoid them. Let's not be too lazy to do some of the hard work of playing with them, of occupying them. Because, you know, occupying them, you have to sit down with them and watch them and guide them play or even play with them. And that takes a lot of time because there's so much to do in spite of all the technology and all the home gadgets that helps us do our work. But there's yet so much to do, especially in Europe where you don't have your extended family members to call upon. Treasure, please help out with Achupete. It fell there. Wait, Treasure will bring it for you. Good girl. Thank you, my princess. Good girl. And treat them to little, little errands. You think they are too small? They are not too small to go on errands. Treat them to little, little errands according to their size. You understand? Even if they go, come into the kitchen, allow them help out. It's very dangerous. You have to keep an eye so they don't, you know, um, end up getting injured or uh, getting involved in domestic accidents yes you have to keep your eye that it makes you more meticulous and it delays your work most of the time but allow them help you don't say go 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 you don't need you yet go go leave this place you keep doing that the time will come that when you need them to help they will still think they are too young to help they will still think it's not safe for them so guide them gradually if they have to enter the kitchen let it be safe and let it occupy them with little things they can do. Just little, little things they can do. And don't let them stay too long there. When they do a little thing, you know children get easily bored. So when they do a little, definitely they will leave the kitchen and go to the next game. So look for the next game. The next game could be music. The next game could be painting. The next game could be writing. The next game could be reading a story. The next game could be anything that is healthy. Could even read the bible to them that is very important and that should be on a daily basis before they sleep or in the morning 
read to them. They may be sleeping. You still read it to their subconscious. It's entering them. The word of God is spirit and it's life. And that spirit is entering them. And that is a good spirit. So don't let the spirit of uh, tablets, phones, and other games there enter your children. And let the spirit in the word of God, which is life, enter them. And they will grow up living a good life. May God grant you wisdom. May God grant you understanding. May God enable you and strengthen you to do this work that is not easy, but very interesting and fulfilling. May God grant us grace to take good care of our children and bring them up in the fear of the Lord, in the way of the Lord, in the love of the Lord, and in the light of God. And when they grow, they will not depart from it. They will give us rest and they will be a blessing. God bless you. See you next time on Jesus Baby Club. Before we go, we'll do a song for you. Treasure, what song are we going to do today? Eva. It rains forever. Oh, okay. Treasure will do it rains forever for you. Treasure, sit down. Let's do it. One, two, go. It rains forever. It rains forever. The principalities and the powers of darkness, my God, erase. The devil lost the battle when my Jesus said it's finished now. Erase, erase. Our God is mighty, is strong, and he reigns forevermore. Our God is mighty. Say goodbye. Goodbye. See you. See you. Take good care of yourself. Take good care of yourself. Be good. good. Don't forget that Jesus loves you. Loves you. Pray for them, treasure. Mercy. Mercy. Mm -hmm. Peace. Mm -hmm. and love. love. Multiplied. Multiplied. Unto us. Does he need a thing? Amen. Oh, let us say. Okay, let us say it. Mercy, go. Mercy, peace, and love. In the last, in Jesus' name. Amen. In case you didn't hear, she said, Mercy, peace, and love be multiplied unto us in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, bye. See you next time on Jesus Baby Club. Say bye. Okay, bye.